make sure you uh, make sure you keep making units. I can't get over how crucial that is. And yep. so now we are seeing a uh, armory go down as well. Might see some Thors over here as well. Yep. Uh, Zombie Mojo is behind a little bit right here, but a lot higher and a lot better than the macro. Oh, but yeah. not as much in the gas. Yeah, does he even have anybody on his gas anymore? He took them uh, yeah, totally off. He has a little bit. No, but he took them off those gases up there. Oh, one. One on gas right now. 48 wow. average. 48, <laughs> 48 gas per minute. It's not good. <laughs> so, right here we're seeing uh, no production by the red player, even though he has 1,200 minerals. So, is he making a push? Where did his army go? I think he's making it. So definitely we need to start seeing some more more macro by both players. The macro by Zombie is a, uh, a little bit better, but definitely need to see, start seeing a lot better macro. with the Because uh, you can see the minerals for both players are very high. 800, 1300, I mean, they just need to be spending them. Keep them as low as you possibly can. That is the name of the game. And we also have a drop over here I completely oh. missed. And this is what I was talking about. See how the uh, supply depots are way spaced out over here? Now the supply went down from like 130 to 100, so that is not good. But it looks like the Mojo is about to lose all of his units right here. So not a very effective drop because he only got two supplies, but very good for Flea. So Flea is in the lead right now, definitely. 2,000 unspent minerals. Wow, he that definitely needs to queue up some minerals right now. Definitely queue up some more Marines and Marauders. My friend, if you were the Flea, this is uh, spend, more, spend more money as much as you possibly can. So... If you're not, uh, definitely need to save as many units as you can whenever you do a go attack. If it's a fail attack, get them out as soon as you can. Yep. And, gotta uh, back out. You gotta know when to get out and when to save your units. Would, because you just lost, like, uh, if this is you, you lost, like, uh, 12 units. And that's pretty, that's a big difference, especially if he moves out right now. It's a big army. A little bit of trash talk going on right now. <laughs> We are seeing a more medbacks come out, more marines. And I, I'd like to see some Thors come out, but I don't know what's going on. I'm probably just a guy that for the uh, second level upgrades for the uh, marines. Yeah, um, I really don't understand why he's not pushing out right now. He totally has the army advantage, and he has defense at his uh, expansion right there with those uh, three um, siege tanks. So I don't know why he's just sitting there hanging out. And he's not really even making that many units either. So another big part is map control. This neither player has map control at all. Both did a uh, drop. One was a little bit more effective than the other, and yet they're both uh, turtling. So two turtling Terrans going on right now. Uh, personally, I like a little bit more of aggressive play rather than uh, turtling play, but that's just my type, and especially. Uh, you have to. Another thing is scouting. You need to figure out what your opponent is doing at all times. Right now, neither player knows anything. They both know that they both have a huge biological ball, but um, Zombie has no idea that the Flea has three siege up tanks in his in his uh, front door, and at the same time, Flea has no idea that Zombie doesn't have any siege up tanks. And so the whole thing is, you need to keep track of what you what your opponent has as much as you possibly can. Yeah. And so that's why they need to keep tabs on each other, but neither player is actually doing that now. How about a scan? They have orbital commands. They could definitely scan and figure out which other have. I've not seen one scan I down. I haven't seen any. Yet. And I'm not going to any air either. Just going straight medbacks. I mean, I would think I'd see like some banshees or something just to go harass a little bit. Yeah, so we're getting uh, shit planting and stuff, and as well, uh, uh, infantry level 1 plating. I mean, uh, attack upgrade. And... I'm curious to see if they're going to start going battle cruisers here soon because he is getting the ship plating. I would like to see some uh, battle cruisers, I guess. Going for another command center, so expansion again. Uh, still has 3,300 3, unspent minerals. Wow. And same from Zombie has 3,000. All right, 2,000. And getting Thors as well. Th Thors now. I would like to see some battle cruiser play. He, uh, he definitely could if he had a fusion core. Neither one of them have fusion cores. But. Definitely get is that a second armory? I think it is. Second He's... armory for the fleet and second engineering base. So these guys are hard macroing, but yet not spending enough of their minerals. Almost four thousand minerals going on right now and twenty three hundred. So it looks like the zombie is doing better in macro. Um could use some more racks with that much money. 
and um, I don't know. I don't know what to say. Uh, definitely keep building units. He has plenty of units queued up right now. He is down to a th 1,300, which is a huge difference in what he had. And now he just needs a crap load of supply pass, which is what he's working yeah. on right now. So I guess he's realizing his fault right now. And still, the fleet needs to realize what is going on. He's only ma he's only queuing up like one or two at a time. And he needs to queue up like a thousand, a thousand. Like, yeah, okay, he only has three okay. Bears, you, know, you know. can't do that, but you can queue up five at a time. <laughs> and eight right here. So I mean. Definitely need to keep things queued up. More Thors if you're going to go Thors. Need to uh, go ahead and get a Tech Lab if you're going to go Battle Cruisers or Banshees. Um, I just definitely need to work on the macro and especially look at these uh, workers right here. Definitely not doing anything. Transfer he hasn't them. Moved them. Come on now. Or something. Um, need to move out right here and secure another expansion, especially uh, maybe the high yield. But also do a scan to realize that it looks like zombies about to move out and yeah. complete nothing going on for the flea. I can't. Oh man, I just can't get over how you have to keep things going. Did uh Three get a little bit more units going on? But you minerals. have to you have to pay attention to your minerals as well. Two thousand gas. gas. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm pretty sure any Zerg would love three thousand gas. Dude, I'd have two thousand gas. Hundred roaches coming at you right now. I'm telling you that right I now. I would have meter like crazy. Oh, so, crazy. um, looks like zombie is moving out over here to the top. Of, mostly to move out to the back doors right now. Is uh no, just going to the Zalnaga Tower. And yet, uh, both players have masked up quite an army. Just kind of moving around, checking things. Going to probably uh, secure this um, this high yield expansion right here. That'll help him out a whole lot more. Uh, seeing he only has 400 minerals, I don't think the flea would is hurting at all in minerals right now. I think no. he's doing absolutely fine. He could take all his workers off and probably still have a minute to finish this game. I don't doubt that. <laughs> but he is getting uh, uh, weapon, ve weapon uh, vehicle upgrades and ship upgrades. Um, I'm not exactly why, sure why he's getting ship upgrades when he's not getting any ships. And we finally saw, I think, the first scan I've caught. I'm not sure if there's been any more. 24 minutes in. 24 minutes game. over in the first <laughs> scan we've seen. And so, uh, yeah, like I said, I'm not sure why he's getting shit plating unless he just wants to protect his medbacks, which isn't very efficient at all compared to the uh, money you spend for it. Uh, just getting more tanks. and Probably, if you're going to go like heavy mech, you should get two factories with that, with that much income. Uh, I mean, yeah, got the got everything upgrading pretty much. Going straight tech right now for just trying to make everything as yeah. best as it can be, I guess. Yeah. I don't understand. A good thing would not would be right now is uh oh both it looks like both players are moving out a little bit. And we might see a battle right here. Yes, oh, finally come on Siege it. up. Siege up. Yes. Oh wow. So Siege is now in play I'm right here. I'm pretty sure that he has the advantage right here. Oh nice. Back up to your tanks. That is huge right there. Good micro. And so now it looks like the fleet is about to take this game right here, no doubt. Easy. Those Thors are gonna th handle uh, some. And oh yeah, I mean they both have Thors, but those siege tanks are taking out that MMM ball very easily. And it looks like the fleet is about to take this game by storm. So bad mac macro, but it all worked out. The fleet should definitely move in by now. Scan and then no, he needs to move in. Easy move in right here. Uh, he needs to just. I mean, I guess he could just make more units. I guess just in case it fails, even though he has it easily. See if you can pay attention to the macro up here. It looks like. Uh, Zombie is going two battle cruisers, which fully needs to move in right now. Have some game sense and move in because two battle cruisers coming in, you don't want that in your face. Even though the Thors would completely rip them apart. Yeah, easy. And so we are seeing uh, no macro by the flea right now. I believe you are the flea. Yeah. I'd I have to say because you told me your worst. His, uh, you said your worst. Uh, probably the worst part of your play is your macro. So I'm gonna have to say that you're the flea. Uh, Definitely need to work on macro and micro together because there's no macro and there's no micro right this second. 6,000 units he has right now, not doing anything. 6,000 minerals. So apparently there's a whole glitch in your computer. Uh, start attacking those rocks right away. Hey, oh. Well, there you go. Now get me a soda. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So it looks like now these battle cruisers are getting getting in on the action but going to go down very fast that marine and thor combo and now broke down the back rocks and going to move in here and don't even really need to because the medvac's getting in the high ground and this game is pretty much over his marines and thor's about to rip this battle cruiser apart and so the flea my friend you have now won this game pretty easily and still no macro going on you have to flip back flip back forth back forth you have yeah. to 
put your units, if you look at right here, your hotkeys down here, normally if you put things in hotkeys, it pops up down here. You need to put, uh, double click your barracks, and you can double click like a lot of them right there. You got all three of them queued, and just do control two, control three, control four, and all you gotta do is press the one, two, three, four keys, or whatever you assigned it to, and you can flip back and forth to your barracks. And you can still stay in battle and press the button, and what, and then you can start making units using the hotkeys. Exactly. It doesn't look like you're using the hotkeys at all, and that's very big. Uh, but good job winning right there. Good micro backing up to the tanks. That was a uh, big turning point in that battle right there. So you did good in the battle, but just your macro is slipping so bad. I'm just going to point to that right there. That's all I need to say. Wow. Um, continue to make units while you're not doing anything. You need to get the upgrades, but also get the units. Uh, instead of just uh, queuing up one or two at a time, queue them up all the way if you have that many minerals. Make more uh, buildings if you have too much income than you can than you're producing. Uh, you had four upgrades going at one time. That's good because you're trying to spin out your minerals, but also make units because if you're not making units, your opponent is, and you're going to get overwhelmed. But yet you beat him in the macro. So good game, by the way, man. So bull, what do you got? What are your thoughts after the game? Uh, I think this was a pretty good game. You know, this is my first commentary. Uh, I watch your channel all the time. I love it. I know you guys love it. All the subscribers are out there I'm with you. So uh, you know, it was great, man. You know, got to do this again. Yeah. Definitely, but uh, like I said, this is a bronze level game. It's by a subscriber. I really appreciate the uh, the video being sent in, and I really hope uh, more of you subscribers will send in your videos and let us cast it. Uh, it doesn't matter what level we'll play, so definitely be looking out. I'll be casting more uh, subscribers in the future. Thanks for watching, guys.